Hi, so in this video we're going to talk about meditations. We're going to do a short mindfulness meditation where we just concentrate on the breathing and we're attempting to slow down the thoughts in the mind and create small spaces where we don't think of anything at all, which can seem quite unnatural to start with. But eventually with regular practice you'll do this more easily and more often and the spaces will become longer. So to start the meditation, we first need to relax the body. For meditation, we can either sit in a chair or we can sit on the floor. It's not recommended to lay down because this is our usual sleeping position that we're used to. And therefore, when we lay down, we're indicating to the body and the mind that we want to sleep. But we don't want to sleep during our meditation. So we can either sit with our feet flat on the floor, giving us lots of connection with the ground, or we can sit on the floor in any way that's comfortable. I will move to the floor in a moment after we've done our body scan to make sure that we're nice and relaxed. So to do our body scan we start with the head and we think of all the muscles and all the joints where necessary and we release any tension and tightness. So we think of the head and the top of the head around the eyebrows, top of the eyes here and around the jaw is where people tend to hold more tension. Sometimes we don't, can't even feel that tension until we actually frown and really use those muscles in the head and then consciously relax them again. So we're relaxing the muscles in the face and the jaw move down to the neck. We continue moving down to the shoulders. It can be, again, quite difficult to decide whether you're feeling tense or not, so just move things around a little bit and then just relax it down. Release tension from the joints of the shoulders and the elbows. Relax the hands and the fingers. Try not to clasp the fingers. We can have a tendency of Clasping the fingers together, it cuts off blood supply and energy circulation. We want to keep our hands nice and loose. They can either just sit in the centre or we can have them just resting comfortably on the knees. We work down, relax all the chest and the stomach muscles. Relaxing the abdominal muscles allows us to do our nice deep abdominal or belly breathing. Release tension from the hips and the pelvis, work down and release the knees. We can quite often hold a lot of tension in the knees, although if we're sitting, it tends not to be such a problem. We hold the tension by pulling the kneecaps upwards. And then we go all the way down, making sure that the ankles are nice and relaxed and that the toes aren't curled up and clenched together. So we can take a few moments just making sure that all around the body is nice and relaxed. Then we can start changing our breathing, concentrating on the breathing and going into our meditation. So now I'm sitting for our meditation. So we need to make sure when we're sitting that the back and the body is straight. And this is to make sure that all of the chakras are nicely aligned. Uh, and this just allows better energy flow. If you put your chin slightly down, tuck it in slightly, this also ensures a nice straight neck at the back. And this will also help with keeping everything nice and straight. You can place your hands as you wish. There's no need to use any hand gestures that you may have seen in books or anywhere, really. Um, they're called mudras, and there are specific mudras that do different uh, or achieve different things. Um, but for a basic mindful meditation, we don't need to do any of those mudras, and we can just relax the hands the, on, the, on the legs or in the centre. Instead of clasping the fingers if we're comfortable in the centre, place one hand in the other, as this helps. You can connect the thumbs, uh, and this keeps a nice energy flow, but it's not important to do that. Uh, and this is just basically another type of mudra. Um, so you can just sit naturally. 
Again, if you're sitting, you need to make sure that everything's nice and relaxed. Do the body scan the same as we did when I was sitting on the chair. You can start focusing on the breathing. The idea of focusing on the breathing is it takes the mind away from thinking lots of endless chatter. And if you think in your head now, you're probably thinking lots of different things what you're going to have for dinner tonight, what you might have done yesterday, something that happened 10 years ago, or perhaps even making up in imagery of something you think might happen in a couple of months' time. So the idea of meditation is to try and calm those, and mindfulness is to try and stay in the moment that we're in. So by using meditation, it helps bring back the mindfulness, bring us back to where we are, and will help continue that during our daily goings on. So now as we focus on the breathing, we're thinking about the breathing in and the breathing out. And we're also thinking about and focusing on the little pauses that happen in between, especially after the breath out. And then as we begin focusing more on the breathing and managing to quiet our thoughts, to quiet the brain, we can start to do our belly breathing. So belly breathing is breathing in through the nose and expanding the stomach out. And then as we breathe out, we breathe out through the mouth and we push the air out with the stomach. We continue to do that. With belly breathing, there won't be so much movement in the chest area and at the top. It'll be mainly belly coming out, the belly coming in. Abdominal, abdominal or belly breathing is probably best practiced early on laying down because you can feel, you can lay your hands on your stomach and you can actually feel the movement of the belly coming up and going down. So going back to our meditation, we're concentrating on the breathing. If you have any thoughts come in, that's fine. Don't be annoyed at yourself or anything else. Just accept it. Don't bother to um, think more on that thought. Just let it go again. It's not important because you're in a safe environment and you're about to start your meditation. So any thoughts that come in really don't matter at the moment. You can't change anything or do anything about them. So we just let them go. We continue to concentrate on the breathing. Every time the mind wanders, really focus more on the breathing. I suppose that mindfulness meditation could also be seen as a type of concentration meditation. You're concentrating on your breathing. So after a period of natural breathing, you can really start to enjoy the belly breathing more. This enables more oxygen around the body and helps to relax. I'd now like you to continue a short time just concentrating on the breathing and having a go we're just going to do a short couple of minutes mindful meditation keeping in mind each time you feel something an emotion comes up or a thought comes up we're just accepting it and focusing back on the breathing again
slowly I want you to start being more aware of the things around you, being aware of where you are, any noises that you can hear, anything outside. And being more aware, you can still continue your nice deep breathing, you can still continue using mindfulness. But the idea now is to come back to awareness. And that is basically your mindful meditation. Practiced regularly, you will see improvements in many areas of life. You'll find it easier to cope with situations. You'll find yourself being less reactive face-to-face um, -face if, you, if something annoys you or upsets you. And you'll find it easier to concentrate, focus and maybe even sleep. Hope you've enjoyed this short video. There will be longer videos and different types of meditation coming soon. But this meditation is a good one to use at the start of any of your Tai Chi practices or even martial arts practices. Done for just for a short time every day this you'll really see improvements.